picture is worth a thousand words. In this case, it's prompting some words, strong words. A political cartoon in the Albuquerque Journal this week has people outraged. News 13's Jeannie Nguyen is here to show us. Kim, this drawing takes a dig at undocumented immigrants, and a lot of people here in Albuquerque are not happy about it. When readers opened their issue of the Albuquerque Journal yesterday, they saw this cartoon in the opinion section. It shows a couple being held at gunpoint by a trio of young gang members. The husband, with his hands up, says, Now, honey, I believe they prefer to be called dreamers or future Democrats. That cartoon is now causing a lot of backlash with people here in Albuquerque. This is just false. Super, super disappointed. The Albuquerque Journal, it is not okay. The image has also created a stir in Washington. In a joint statement, members of New Mexico's congressional delegation say they respect the free press, but they do not agree with referring to a group of people as criminals. They say the cartoon is obviously racist. So it's not only attacking undocumented youth and families, it's also attacking Democrats. So what does that say about the Albuquerque Journal? Where do they stand? The picture itself was syndicated from this website, Kegel Cartoons. After receiving a lot of backlash for the cartoon, the journal published these two articles. Karen Moses, the journal's editor-in-chief, says the goal of the image was only to create a conversation and not to offend anyone. She added that, quote, It appeared to us to be poking at President Trump's rhetoric by portraying a quaking Republican couple who were painting dreamers with a broad, totally false brush. She did apologize if it offended anyone. But for many people in Albuquerque, the damage has been done. This is not how you engage a conversation, by attacking our immigrant community. We're not criminals. Our youth is not criminals. Our families are not criminals. The DACA program is expected to expire next month on top of speaking out against the cartoon image in the paper. Many people marched downtown this afternoon to protest the end of the DACA program. Kim, back to you. Okay, thanks, Jeannie. Now, protest is also planned at the Albuquerque Journal building today. It is being organized by the Answer Coalition of New Mexico.